He's a uh, San Antonio inventor, entrepreneur, and tech pioneer. Now, new tech founder Tim Jennison can add art detective to his list of titles. JT Street shows us how Tim's quest to trace the steps of a Dutch master mm. could soon turn the art world on its head on Street's Corner. New tech founder, digital pioneer, and pinball wizard Tim Jennison cuts through some clutter in his office to grab what appears to be a priceless painting by 17th century Dutch master Johannes Vermeer. Yeah, just office. slid in there <laughs> Security through obscurity. I don't like the dots. I'm going to scrape them off. Which he can do because Tim actually painted this himself as a way to prove a theory that first came to him in high school art class. I remember Mr. Thorpe, our art teacher, showing us slides of the Dutch masters. And I said, Mr. Thorpe, it looks to me like these guys are trying to make color photographs. And he said, no, 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 that's not what painting's about. So I had to make this film to show that Mr. Thorpe was wrong. That film is Tim's Vermeer, a documentary where Teller from Penn & Teller follows Tim as he proves his high school hypothesis. This fall off of light is something that an artist really cannot see. There must be a way to actually get the colors accurate. And if you could trace the color, in other words, exactly copy the color at each point on that painting, you basically have a handmade photograph. To test his theory, Tim recreated a room from one of Vermeer's paintings, then, using 17th century technology, recreated the painting the way he thinks Vermeer would have done it. The comparator mirror lets me compare the paint color to the actual object until they're exactly right. The result? Picture perfect. What it means is Vermeer was painting literally what he saw. I respect Vermeer more now that I think that he did this because not only was a, he a great artist, but he was also a kind of a geek. And by bringing those views together, Tim's Vermeer and his film show how science, art, and nerdy obsession can help us see the world in a new light. Creative types come up to me after the film and they say, you told my story. I paint all those dots on that carpet and the viewer has no idea what went into it. So thanks for doing that. Now, if you want to see Tim's Vermeer, well, it's probably hiding under something in his office. If you want to see the movie, though, it opens in San Antonio on March 7th. If you'd like to paint your way onto Streets Corner, you can follow me on Twitter at Streets Corner or at Facebook.com slash Streets Corner. JT Street, Fox News at 9.